I was born and raised in Manila. So at that time, you know, the technology and you know what they can offer, it was just pull out your teeth and here's dentures. So what happened, I actually it was an accident. I tripped and fell and my face hit the ground and broke my tooth, you know, front teeth. So I've had my dentures for 25 years. Tina had an accident when she was young in the Philippines. She's been a patient for so many years that there were different times when we did different treatment plans, but there came a time when we decided the best approach was to move forward with rebuilding her upper arch, her upper set of teeth with dental implants. I'd like to be able to just really, you know, get up, brush my teeth, do my hygiene, and then just go and not have to fuss and, you know, take off a dentures. And I think that also affects my confidence and being very cautious on how I look. The dental implants are placed in strategic locations to connect to an entire set of teeth. You don't need a dental implant for each tooth, but you need enough dental implants to support the bridge work for the rest of your life. We took a look at the amount of bone that she had and used every technology available to make a decision about the best and strongest way to do that. In her case, four significant implants holding her entire set of upper teeth. I think it adds more confidence in myself being able to not worry about, oh, the dentures will fall off versus, you know, the full implant is just secured and beautiful. It's just the best thing that ever happened. Tina always smiles and is always enjoyable to be around. I feel like she can smile even bigger and she's just for sure very confident and happy with the way her teeth look. I always smile and I think that's what um, people tend to comment from about me as far as, oh you have a beautiful smile or you have a beautiful teeth. And it's like, yeah? <laughs> so then I smile even bigger. <laughs>